Hey guys, John from FlyMikeAlpha.com and today we're here at the Punta Gorda Air Traffic Control Tower, a Class D airport, to talk to the controllers about what they expect from us when we're flying our drones in their airspace and how to go about that to get permission from them and what sort of information they'll want to get from us. So, because uh, a lot of guys actually now, a lot of these student pilots are getting into drones and they're making it easier, effective Monday, all the new rule changes and whatever. So, what do you want from us if we were flying three miles away? Call, um, call and then how you do you find a calls? telephone number? Because um, it's not listed like an AFD necessarily or a chart If supplement. you call into the FBOs, they'll usually give you a tower. So, call up the FBO, yeah. maybe call flight service and talk right. to a briefer and they'll hand we over. Fill out that and if you look on the right side, those are the questions we're going to have. Okay. Yeah. So it's really basic, and we don't deny the service unless there's going to be a particular hazard to airplanes. But literally, we're going to ask who's calling, what's your registration mm -hmm. number for your drone, when are you going to fly it, how high, mm -hmm. how long are you going to fly, just so if we have an airplane in the Assuming area, you say, not right there is drone activity. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there is drone activity three miles north of 500 if someone decides they're flying low or something. Very cool. Um, and then, you know, we'll approve it. I mean, it, it would be a, a pretty extreme situation for us to to say unable. And if we disapprove it, we literally have to explain why and log it into the FAA and all that. Mm -hmm. So it's it's <laughs> not a matter of anyone trying to deny someone the ability mm -hmm. to go fly the drone and, and do what they want to do. It's simply a matter of, you know, trying to give the towers awareness so they can call traffic Make sure or out there, yeah, issue the, the advisory, right. Because if they see them, they'll be like, yes, we know, but it's violating what he had told us. Mm -hmm. McChaney Brothers has a some drones, mm -hmm. and, but they've got airport authority. So I mean, if mm -hmm. it's something like that, if you want to operate exactly three miles northwest of the field on the approach end of one five, it's probably a good idea to get the airport authority on that because mm -hmm. we're not going to approve it. Yeah, and I, I wouldn't. I don't even think we'd entertain it. Mm -hmm. If it's above our head or it has to be done, then uh, it's mm -hmm. the airport that would approve it. Okay, yeah. hmm. gotcha. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching, and thank you so much for sharing us on Facebook, Twitter, and all the other social media sites. If you have any questions about the video at all, just leave them in the comments below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Be sure to give us a thumbs up on our video, and you can subscribe to us to keep up with all our latest episodes right over here on the right. Also, check out some of these other helpful videos below, and remember, if you can't fly every day, then fly at MikeAlpha.com. We'll see you all next time.